interesting way to start the episode, wasn't it? Kind of, maybe, I don't, I don't know. It could be terrible, it could be not terrible. Who knows? Who knows? But, I have done things, yes, 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 yes. Uh, pay no mind to that. <laughs> that was nothing. Uh, I have finally got the cobblestone shell of this thing pretty much laid out. There's a few little holes and things and stuff in here, but that's okay. Uh, not, not a big deal. Oh, and apparently there's one very large hole that I need to fill in. <laughs> this makes my life so much easier. <laughs> so much. Uh, yes, good. Okay. Oh, and there's this one too. Cool. I totally forgot a side and didn't even realize it. But my goal for today is, barring the terrible, horrible mess that is the inside of that, uh, where I was messing with stuff, is to basically uh, try and get most, if not all of this, completely filled in with the Z-Tones blocks. Because I, I've mentioned it before that I'm, oh, what, no, I don't want that. I just wanna put, I want to put one block right there. <laughs> I wanna get that little platform thing cleared out eventually. And by eventually, I mean as soon as freaking possible, because it's it's getting a little crowded. <laughs> it's getting a lot crowded, actually. Uh, so yeah, that's that's a thing that I want to do, and I have to uh, finish this to to do that. So I'm not really sure. Ooh, crap! I'm not really sure how some of this is gonna work. Like, the slanted areas, I'm not really sure what's going to go there or anything like that. But, you know, we'll, we'll work it out. I'm assuming that the first floor is going to be probably, probably on this level here, right here. Yeah, right there looks like a good space for it. And then that'll give us some, some, <coughs> that'll give us enough space to kind of build out on this, should we want to. Because, I mean, I could, well, I guess, no, it wouldn't even have, it would be on, oh. No, uh, right, okay. That's right, it would be on this level. Because then, um, yeah, yeah, that's right, it would be on that level. So, like, this, this would be the floor level. Because then you wouldn't have, it would come out and open up. Okay, I, I got this. Oh. Oh. That is a problem. <laughs> Dang it. That's not supposed to happen. Okay. It's the only bad thing is that if I forget to take out my support things, then it's, it's, it's a little too big sometimes. But that's okay. So I think that that will be an accomplishable goal this this episode. It's going to take a lot of work for me to get the, the Z-Tones blocks and stuff, but that sh shouldn't be an issue. I did try to auto-chisel them. I made an auto-chisel, and I tried to chisel them, but... Of course, glass and Z-Tones blocks are like the only two things that you can't auto-chisel. Which is stupid. So, I have to chisel them on my hand. Which is even stupider. <laughs> because I would have loved to just pump them all into an auto-chisel and let them go. And not have to worry about it. And then come back and grab them as needed. But of course, the universe says no. Now. It's too easy, Jello. That's too easy. You have a builder's wand that will do everything for you. You gotta choose the little blocks yourself. But that's okay. There we go. Problem pretty much solved. <laughs> pretty much. Um, what is going on right here? Oh. Right. Of course. Of course. So I don't have any dirt. But that's okay. Um, what do I have as far as blocks go? Uh, nothing in there. Okay, I have some. 
some of these. Let's see. And then I'm sure I will go back probably in the midst of some of this. And actually this needs to come out one more, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. This needs to come out like this. <coughs> I'll probably come back uh, to save myself some of the Zetons blocks. Because I'm going to be changing them out for... Uh, like in the corners and stuff. Or like right here. I will come back and take them out and replace them with factory blocks. Just so I can get a few of them back and I don't end up with like a million extras. <sighs> but I'm also going to need... Is it just... Oh, no, there's plenty of people on it. It's like, what? Um, also, going to need some more magnum torches because this place will be crawling with mobs. I know it. Up there already, I can see it. At the top of the tower, they're, they're going to be up there. So I don't know how we're going to lay this out as far as floors go or pipes or anything like that. Yep, see? Here they are. But I actually hit build limit. I was going to go a little bit taller with the tower, make it look a little better, but... But I hit build limit. <laughs> uh, that's a problem. So this this blog is actually at 255, so I can't can't put anything above it. Dang it! I wanted to make this a little bit taller. That's okay. No, no. <clears throat> I wish I could see what these. Wait, well these are mob nodes, so it doesn't matter. I don't know anything about Thumbcraft. I was kind of considering that maybe I get into Thumbcraft, but I really feel like I would hate it if I did, just because I've seen other people do it and I know how grindy it is. And I don't know. But I also want to not be that person and dismiss a mod because I've seen other people do it. And uh, from watching it, I have an assumption of how it's going to be. So, you know, that's... Yeah, I, I may get into it. I don't know. I don't know what it would offer me if I got into it. <laughs> that's that's the probably the biggest thing is I have no idea what Thumbcraft even has to offer. Do I have? I don't really have anything. Ah, I shouldn't even do that in cobblestone. And that cricket, that cricket man. I swear it's the last one left. It's the last one left. I can't find it. I hear it. I know the general area that it's at, but I can't find it. It's under something. Yeah, see, this is where I tried to auto chisel stuff. I had my diamond chisel in there, but like, see if I take this and I go like this and I put one vect block in there. Did you? Okay, you're, you're in there. Good. Okay, and then does this have any easy tones blocks? No, of course not. Um, it's probably because I took them all out. Z, oop, that's not a Z jello, Z tones. Let's take those and then see if I put them in here. Then it will take them, but it's not actually chiseling them. And I have an automation upgrade in there just so I could, oh, what is it? What? The frick? What are you doing? Stop. No, what? Oh my god. Oh my, oh my, oh my, please. Please. Please, I beg of you. What is going on here? Okay. Will you... Will you take these blocks and make them into... What is going on here? What is this do What? <laughs> it was not doing this before, I swear. Okay, so it's, it's it's okay with unchiseling them, but I have I have a vect block in here. Why would you unchisel that? Wait, 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 wait. If I put that in as a z-tone tile, will this do something? What is going on here? I no no say, no say. Okay, so this is the target slot that's taking a z-tone tile. It's not what I want it to do. I am so confused. 
Is it just slapping them? Oh, it's just slapping them in every slot. I see. Okay, please. Poor Favor, stop. Poor Favor. Okay, it's not actually chiseling anything. Dang it, I thought it was gonna do something, but it's not. It's just gonna be stupid. So if I put that in there, and then I put a Z-Tone block in there, yeah, see, it's not actually gonna chisel it. It's just gonna fill up every slot it possibly can with Z-Tone's blocks. Very nice. Very nice. That's completely what I wanted it to do. Yay. Okay, so never mind. Dang it, I thought that it was actually gonna do something. But it looks like it's just having to flip out. Flip out. Fl it's just flipping out. Hello, loud car. Nice of you to stop by the whole day. So yeah, that's not gonna do anything. I'm just stupid. But, oh my goodness. Okay, let's see if there's anything still in here. Oh my. How did I, how do you get Quicksilver? Oh, you smelt cinnabar. Oh, I didn't realize that that got you quicksilver. Okay. Interesting. Oh, there's obsidian in here. No wonder it's not doing anything. You can't smell the obsidian. Oh, well, is this thing full of coal already? Oh, it is. Oh, oh, that's a problem. Oh, why? I need emerald upgrades so bad. So bad. So bad. Maybe I shouldn't be smelting these ores anymore. Huh. You know, I think I shouldn't. I think that I should not be smelting these anymore. Because this is getting a little ridiculous. Okay. I see. Shoot. Because I'm running out of space. Like, I'm not getting enough emeralds from this. Like, for real, so I'm not getting enough emeralds from this. Like, this is silk touching everything right now, and I'm, I think I've gotten one emerald ore as it's worked its way through this, and I think I need to turn. Oh my, okay. Oh, I have to rethink how I do this. Because I put this on silk touch to see if I could get emerald ore. But I think I'm going to put fortune back on. Forge. For, fought, fought, forge. Fortune, yeah. I'm going to put my fortune upgrade back on there. That's, that's bad. That's bad, that's bad, that's bad. Because I am seriously, I'm not getting enough. I mean, this is still working its way through the chunks. It's like hardly even close to done. Because I set up I set up a large quarry on purpose so that I wouldn't have to do multiple. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's take the silk touch off. And replace it with fortune. Yeah, see? See it's it's well it's getting there. It's getting there as far as being done, but it's still got a ways to go. Dang, man. But yeah, there is like no emerald ore. There is, there is no emerald. It's sad. <sighs> but I had some touch on there. But then, well, maybe, maybe I shouldn't do, f do I do fortune or not? Well, I guess that would make sense because I need things like, um, I need things like redstone, not in ore form. And then it would just, pick up the ores. Oh my goodness. Oh god, this is, this is conflicting, man. I don't even know. I'll have to figure something out. Uh, just because this is getting a little ridiculous with the amount of junk that I'm picking up here. And I feel like, let me, let me, let me get some, I feel like I need, do I have any caches? Caches? I have a cash. Uh, what's it take to make a, ooh, uh, where'd you go? Oh, I put an R in there by mistake. Uh, what's it take to make you? Right, well, what's it take to make a... Okay, it's just tin. I got plenty of tin, man. Interesting. I could make quite a few of these, yep. And then... Um... This is hardened. 
And that's Invar. I can make Invar pretty easily. Oh my god, I might have to switch these storage drawers out for caches just because I'm not getting, like, I'm running out of space. I mean, I love storage drawers and I love the compacting drawers. The only thing I wonder about is this has, like, a storage drawer controller that will separate stuff. Do caches do that? I haven't really looked at caches. Oh, Okay, cash. Yes, yeah, okay, you see, so they have, like, up to resident cash, but it doesn't, I don't know that they sort the same way. I don't know that they sort the same way. I'm gonna have to think, I'm gonna have to think about that. I'm gonna put these, put these in here and think about that. Uh, but I'm gonna get to work on doing the things and probably, uh, I'm gonna, I think I'm just gonna get to work on the Z-Tones blocks and stuff over there and I'll work with the storage drawers once I get everything moved over. Because this is, this is, I mean, a cache, you can, you can break a cache and it won't drop its contents, right? Right. That's, that's what I thought. Okay, so that's a whole lot easier than using matter transporters for... Uh, no. <laughs> then using matter transporters to move storage doors, which is, I mean, that's not a big deal. But, I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm gonna have to think about that. Okay, so, many, many hours later, it would seem, I have done things, and I have gotten a lot, a lot more done, actually. Um... Oh god, I hope that. Okay, so I'm afraid there's gonna be a chunk error in the middle of this thing again. Uh, that happens sometimes, and it's not fun. But I have made what is going to be a giant window filled with tinted glass, essentially. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a thing. I'm not gonna do one on the other side just because I wanna save room. Like, this is a large area, and I feel like there might be another floor up here. And I don't, or several floors even, you know, if I split this off. And I don't wanna have to deal with having a large open window and worrying about blocking that off or anything. And then there's still all of this space up there past that point and everything like that. <laughs> it's a little nutty how much, I mean, there's gonna be so much space, so I need elevators galore, probably. Um, I was actually thinking about using those, um, what are they called? Uh, let's see, tube. If I do tube, does it work? Yes, it does. These things, transport tubes. Because these are really freaking cheap as heck. And you can, like, change the direction that they go. I don't know how you do that exactly. Oh, I see. I see. So you make a down one out of the normal ones. And then you make an up one out of the down one. And then you make um, a north one out of the up ones. And... Okay, okay, so you just essentially just keep combining them to make a new one. Okay, that's cool. So they can go in any direction you want based on it. They go up, down, north, south, east, west. I think that's pretty freaking awesome. And I would love to use those both for getting in the base and for uh, getting around inside of it. Because those look cooler than elevators, honestly. And they got kind of, I don't know if they're actually shiny light, like shiny light up things. But, you know, actually, let's just, 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 this is much faster. Let's see if I can't make one of these real quick, actually. Let's just, 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 just have a, have a, oh wow, that makes a lot, okay. Whoa. Okay. Oh, what? So is there a, a way to change the color? Or does it just, like, you wait for it to change color and then it does things? Okay, that's interesting. So how does one get in these things? Do you just, you just, just how, how do you, how do you use these? How do you use them? Wait, tube station, okay. And that's, that's really, okay, okay, okay. We're testing things, we're testing things. Boop. Okay, so I want one of these. Tube station H, okay, interesting, interesting. Whoa, okay, so if I, 
that's not the right spot for it, but if I put it right here. Whoa! Whoa! Cool! Okay, that's cool. That's really freaking cool. These are dirt cheap, man. Holy crap. Okay, so how do I change the color? Is it, do I shift? Is it shift? No. Or is it, you just, okay. How, how, okay, did they just, oh, oh. Oh, they change the color based on what direction you're looking in. Interesting. So one, and once you've set a direction, you can't change it. Okay. I get it. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. I like this very much. Okay. I get it. That's really freaking awesome, man. Yeah. It sucks that you can't, like, change the color of these to, like, you know, like, be a, you know, like, blue or whatever. But that's still really cool. Like, I would still use that, you know, regardless of the color. Because it's highly, like, a futuristic-y kind of thing. And I think that that works a lot better than uh, elevator blocks because those are so cheap. I mean, especially since it's not like I have a shortage of ender pearls or anything and it's not like I can't make more. <laughs> But I mean, that is, that is, wow. And then if you want to set a direction by via thing, okay, I get it. You do that. I, I get it. I feel it. I like it. I think that's pretty freaking awesome. <laughs> that's really cool. So, <laughs> this has been kind of a really buildy episode. Uh, that time lapse took several, like, like an hour to make uh, of just me, like, going around doing stuff here and then... This has been another couple hours, so I mean it's been a buildy episode, and I think I think that we're gonna call it for today. So I, th I, I I think so. I think so. So I think that that is all I have time for today. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see y'all next time. Jello out. Oh, and for the record, caches do not work like storage drawers. Dumb. <laughs>